Hello, hello. Let's read our morning message. Good morning, kindergarten stars. Today is Monday, May 11th, 2020. I can't wait to share our weekend news together this afternoon. So we have another whole group Google Meet today. And today, instead of sharing our Medford projects, which we did last week, we're going to share what we did this weekend. So I still want you to write and draw what you were up to this weekend. And then I would love for you to share it with your friends today at our meeting. It's at 2. Um, okay, so I crossed off our weekend days. The ninth was um, Saturday. That was World Migratory Bird Day, which I never knew about. I think I mentioned it to you guys when we opened up the May calendar. And my weekend news has a little bit to do with that. And then yesterday, the 10th, was Mother's Day. So I hope that you guys got a chance to celebrate with the important women in your life who help take care of you, like moms and grandmas and aunts. Um, and today is the 11th, so I'm going to cross off the 11th. And today we have a new um, poem to read, and it has to do with the book we read last week, the Gail Gibbons book, From Seed to Plant. So let's check it out. I had to get a little creative with our poems. I'm hanging it on the back of my door so you guys can see it, but I was able to grab this from our classroom and it's a poem about seeds and plants. So it's called Little Seed. Little seed in the ground below felt the warmth of the sun's glow, heard the raindrops pitter patter, wondered why the birds did chatter. So the seed began to grow and poked its head up very slow. What it saw was such a sight. The plant was in a garden bright. So we're gonna do a little bit of visualizing with this poem this week. So um, next time we read it, I want you to think about what the picture in your head is that um, is painted when we read those words. Okay, all right, we have, um, I'm doing a science lesson with you guys today that I think you guys are really gonna like. We're gonna do some planting, so I'll see you soon.